So hopefully lighter news, some better news. Yeah. I guess it just depends on what you like. So what are you serving up in the weather department, meteorologist Catherine Maxwell? Well, kind of a mixed bag for some of us. Some of us are going to see a little bit of some spotty rain, while some of us are going to stay dry. Now, all of us will be a little bit warmer today, though, and we'll keep on warming things up throughout this work week. Here's the radar rain loop from yesterday, the past 24 hours. We are seeing that pretty much most of the southwestern parts of our viewing area saw most of the rain yesterday. Saw a few thunderstorms in there with some heavy downpours, but some of us, especially the eastern half, really lacked in that precipitation yesterday. So today, rain chance is even lower. So we are looking at pretty much a mostly dry day today with a couple of spotty showers possible. Now we do still see a little bit of some light rain in the parts of our viewing area this morning. Morning, but you can tell most of us are dry and this is kind of how it's really going to look throughout much of the day today. So not a bad idea. Have the umbrella on standby, but you may not need it at all. Now we do have the system that's off towards the east. This is going to stay stalled here actually throughout the rest of this work week and we have high pressure that's nearby too. Both of these in combination are what's going to bring us a chance for some sun and some clouds and also a chance for a little bit of some rain and even possibly an isolated storm throughout the afternoon hours. Now today we're just going with a 30 percent chance chance for that rain. So we think 30% of the viewing area could see a shower or an isolated storm, meaning most of us will be dry. Temperatures will be slightly warmer today than what we saw yesterday. Most of us will see highs in the middle and upper 70s and the 80s, which is slightly below normal for this time of year. Usually Bluefield, West Virginia's normal high temperature is right at 79 degrees. So we're a little bit cooler than normal for us today. This morning we are starting off with temperatures in the 50s and the 60s. We will warm up and eventually overnight we'll drop back down to what we're seeing this morning. Now we do have an opportunity just like last night to see a stray shower still into the viewing area, but altogether most of us will still be dry even tonight. Tomorrow pretty much a copy and paste forecast going to see a few spotty showers into the area for us and we do have the opportunity still for an isolated storm into the afternoon and temperatures will mainly hold upper 70s and the 80s for our Thursday. So pretty much we're looking at a dry work week for us. On Saturday we do raise our rain chance just a little bit, but it looks to be in the form of some scattered showers and thunderstorms. So still some of the area may still need to water that garden because some of us could still be dry. Let's fast forward to next week. This work week we've seen below normal temperatures Next week's going to be a whole different story. We are talking about a warm up for us. High temperatures will mainly read into the 80s and even the lower 90s for us. We'll start to see the 80s build back into our area on Friday and we'll hold on to that all throughout the next work week. So we'll still see a chance just for a stray shower or two today, tomorrow, and even into Friday. Saturday, just a few scattered showers and isolated storms. But it still looks like most of us are going to stay fairly dry.